Hey guys, and welcome back to the Acne channel. Today, we are going to be doing a Get Unready With Me. Um, we're gonna be talking about, you know, acne, skincare, doing like a chill, you know, night skincare routine while using some of the banished products. I'm gonna be going through my routine with you guys and just chatting. So it's going to be a little bit more of a laid back video, not as informational as we usually get here. So I hope you guys enjoy it and let's get right on into it. So honestly, my night skincare routine is my favorite time of the day because I just get to unwind and relax after a long stressful day of school and work. I'm sure a lot of you guys can relate. And honestly, it's been really important for me to practice self-care lately, especially with all the craziness that's going on in the world right now. Um, just to take some time to yourself and practice some self-care is really important. And through skincare, I find that I do that best. So let's just go ahead and light up a candle. I like to do this just to really get in that relaxation mode side and I'm just gonna pop on a little headband all right so I do have some makeup on like some uh, a bit of face makeup and some eye makeup so of course we got to take that off and I like to do a double cleansing method so I'm gonna first go in with a cleansing oil this one is from Numbazin it is their quick clean one and basically just take some of this this will really help break up that makeup on the skin and the SPF. And I like doing a double cleanse with an oil or a cleansing balm before just to kind of nourish my skin, especially because I have very, very dry skin. And I find this works really great for me. So just massage this in. It's kind of relaxing too because this oil does feel really nice on the skin. Okay, so now that everything's kind of melted off, that oil kind of dissolved all that makeup off, I'm just gonna go ahead and rinse this off. All right, so I just rinsed that oil off and now it's time to actually do the second part of the double cleansing, which is a actual water-based cleanser. This is the All Clear Mint Cleanser from Banish. I really like this stuff, it has aloe in it, so it's gonna help soothe out my skin, some different extracts and peppermint too, which can help reduce redness as well. So I just kind of take like two pumps of that. My skin's still damp, so I just rub this in. Cleanse off the day. I love a clean face and taking off my makeup. It's so satisfying. And after I've worked this gel cleanser into the skin for about a minute or two, I'll go rinse it off. All right, so now my skin is fully cleansed and dry and it feels so nice. Not over stripped at all, which is definitely what I like to get out of my cleansing routine with this kind of double cleansing method and using a cleanser that's not too stripping to the skin, of course. So now I want to do a little treatment. I love doing treatments, especially, um, you know, right before I go to bed for my night routine. It's so soothing to the skin. So I'm going to be taking the pumpkin enzyme mask. This is literally one of my favorite masks out there. It smells like pumpkin pie. I especially love this in the fall time. This stuff seriously just makes my skin so glowy. It's insane. Helps with breakouts too. Just, you know, has those exfoliants in there. Helps with hydration due to those AHAs. So we have glycolic acid in here, which is gonna resurface the skin as an AHA, but it's also going to just help brighten up the skin and all of that. We also do have that pumpkin in there. I'm like running low on this. I love this stuff so much. I use it all the time. And it's one of those exfoliating treatments that I actually feel like makes a difference in my skin. Like I feel it exfoliating. My skin always feels brighter and definitely like glowy after using it. But I also don't feel like it completely ruins my moisture barrier, if you know what I mean. So it's a great balance and I definitely feel like a pumpkin pie while I'm wearing it. So I usually like to keep this on for like 10 to 15 minutes, just because my skin is more sensitive. If you're less sensitive, you could probably leave this on for about 20, but my skin is just pretty sensitive, so I like to keep this on for about 10 minutes. But yeah, we even have vitamin C in here, amazing for helping with acne scars and brightening up that skin. Vitamin E, super nourishing. Glycerin too. I just love this stuff. It's the perfect little exfoliating mask really nice for a nice refresh at night 
We're gonna skip micro needling tonight. I usually will do this about once to twice a month. I don't do it that often using the Banisher 2.0, but because I didn't want to do a mask treatment today, I don't like to use these two together just because it can be a lot on the skin. So I would do this. I would definitely do this another time, but exfoliating can be a really nice like keep up, I would say with micro needling since it can help resurface the skin and help your skin look glowy. But yeah, I'm just gonna keep this on for 10 to 15 minutes. All right, so it has been about 10 minutes since I've been wearing the mask. So I'm gonna go ahead and rinse it off. All right, so I am back. My skin is washed off of the mask and look at that glow. Like I love this glycolic mask, this pumpkin enzyme because it just makes my skin so glowy and luminous and I love it. Like it looks so refreshed every time I use it. It feels so soft too. So now we're gonna continue on with the rest of my skincare. I am having some hormonal breakouts over here, which is totally okay. Acne is normal. Stress acne happens, hormonal acne happens. It's okay, but in these times, I really wanna be careful with my skincare and use stuff that will be nourishing to my skin to kind of help with that healing process. So I'm gonna use the Centella Unscented Toner from Purito. I really like this stuff because Centella is really calming to the skin. And since I have sensitive skin, this really helps. But notice how like the mask, even though it did such a good job exfoliating and kind of resurfacing my skin and giving them, me that really nice glow, it didn't make my skin red. So really great for someone who wants an exfoliating mask but doesn't want anything too sensitizing. And next, I'm gonna go in with the iUnique Black Snail Restore Serum. I really like this, especially when my acne is kind of healing, like these ones over here, just to give me that nourishment and hydration to the skin. It's a really nice one under um, creams too, so press that in and don't be shy to take the skincare down the neck. Next, I'm going to apply the Fighter Gel from Banish on some of these breakouts I'm having. Really love this stuff for breakouts, especially for my super sensitive skin because it's very soothing to the skin at the same time as being antibacterial. We have aloe leaf extract in here, Mila leaf extract, which is also amazing. Kind of calming down the skin because it's green tea, so that's a really good antioxidant. We have peppermint in here. It's also really good for rosacea because it's not drying to the skin, which is really nice since I have acne prone but dry skin. So I just apply a thin layer over spots I'm having right now. And this always helps calm them down like overnight. It's crazy. I'm just gonna let that kind of sit on the skin for a little bit. Now, I love my skin treatments, as I said. So something to really just you know, help me detox the day. I love doing these facial rollers. They don't do much. They do some lymphatic drainage, but I just love the feel of them, honestly. This one's an ice roller. You can kind of get them anywhere. But I'll just roll this onto the skin, do some massaging, go like down the neck and the jawline. I just find this so relaxing on the skin. Part of that self-care routine, you know? Don't do this every night. Sometimes you just don't have the time, but if you have the time, why not treat yourself, right? This pimple on my lip is really inflamed, but it's not hurting as much. And I definitely think I owe it to the fighter gel. So let's keep moving. To help with some of those whiteheads I'm experiencing right now that are kind of in their final stages of the healing process, I like to apply some little acne patches, um, some just hydrocolide patches. This just helps kind of absorb that gunk out of them. And I find with having an acne treatment underneath, like the fighter gel, is a really nice combo. Press that on, take the skin. So now it's time to moisturize. I'm gonna go in with the vitamin C cream. This stuff is amazing. If you have dry skin or you just want a cream with vitamin C in it that's gonna help brighten the skin. Oh, you need this stuff, guys. I love it. Sometimes I'll keep it in my skincare fridge too for that cooling sensation and just to kind of keep that vitamin C in there. Nice and fresh for longer, but this is great. This is definitely the ultimate brightening skin routine that I'm showing you guys here because my skin always looks so glowy and bright after I use these Vanish products. I'm just careful around those acne patches. Again, let's take our skincare down our neck. I'm gonna apply some of this on the chest. So now that I'm all moisturized up, I'm going to go ahead and apply 
some oil. Now you can apply this before the cream. I just find at night, I like to apply the oil over the cream. It's just kind of how I like to do it. Just a few drops, you don't need much. And I press it on top because I just find it like kind of creates like this inclusive barrier. And when I wake up in the morning, my skin feels so soft and like moisturized, hydrated and glowy. So I just like to pat this oil in on top. And this banish oil is just like vitamin C goodness. We got vitamin E in here too, glycerin, aloe, a little bit of rosehip oil, which is awesome for scarring, pigmentation, all of that inflammation in the skin. So really great ingredients. All right, so now I'm done my routine. I can blow my candle out and I'm about to head to bed. That's really all there is. Take out my headband so that is it for my nighttime routine get on ready with me um for this really bright and glowy skin look my skin feels so good right now and i'm definitely ready to rest up for the night so hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for joining me on this nighttime skincare routine i hope you enjoyed and if you did make sure you give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the acne channel i'll see you guys very soon and make sure to join us on our next video bye guys